State Fire Marshal's office is looking into a fire that broke out early this morning in downtown Marlin. Thankfully, no one was injured, but flames did destroy a building, a business, and put a Christmas charity in jeopardy. Fox 44's Hannah Hoover shows us the wreckage. A fire was reported shortly after 1 a.m. this morning in downtown Marlin, consuming a flower shop called the Petal Patch and affecting a nearby hospital. The Marlin Fire Department arrived on scene within four minutes to find smoke pouring from the building near the Falls County Hospital. We were able to knock down a body of fire. Um, immediately had resources from Marlin Volunteer Fire Department arrive on scene with their ladder truck and additional personnel were able to re-enter the building and resume the interior attack. The city of Belmede brought in its tower ladder to help Marlin fight the fire with volunteer firefighters around Falls County rushing in to help. At its height, approximately 50 firefighters worked to contain the fire, although the proximity of the railroad made it challenging. To fight this fire with uninterrupted water supply, um, they had concerns early on that passing trains, the vibrations could cause structural collapse. Um, they've been very vigilant about ensuring that trains coming through are slow, um, keep an eye on everything. Fire Chief Parker says older buildings like the ones downtown fall under older coats. When a fire occurs with our modern appliances, our modern uh, interior furnishings, they spread quickly and uh, get out of hand very rapidly. Right now, the state fire marshal's office is investigating the fire. We have three investigators on the scene right now, and fortunately, no injuries or life loss occurred as a result of this fire or the firefighting operations. While no one was injured, the flower shop was holding toys for children this holiday season. We lost over 20 boxes of toys that were donated to our Falls County children for Toys for Tots. That's 20 boxes of toys we didn't have, now we don't have it again. So um, we're just looking, and if anybody's willing to step up and, you know, donate for our children, because Toys of Tots, we start that this week. Some community members are raising concern because this is the third downtown fire in recent years. In Marlin, Hannah Hoover, Fox 44 News.